Hi, I'm Troy from Sonic Tremor Media, and today I'm going to show you how to attach a Nexus 7 tablet like this to a Nikon D3200 digital SLR. Although it might take some fooling around with different apps until you find the right one for your camera, this works with most DSLRs. Once you find the right app, you'll be able to use your tablet as a live field monitor and remote control. But first, you'll need a few parts. First, you'll need a micro USB 2.0 OTG adapter. OTG stands for on the go. This cable will plug into your Android tablet and allow you to connect it to your camera's USB port. You can find these online, but I got mine at the local Radio Shack. The link for this adapter is in the info bar on this video's YouTube page. Next, get a shoe adapter for your camera. You can also get fancier models with articulating arms, but I chose this simple Revo adapter with the quarter inch threaded post. Next, choose a tablet mount that will fit your tablet and connect it to your shoe adapter. I chose this square jellyfish tablet tripod mount. It has spring-loaded arms and fits any 7-inch tablet in portrait or landscape. The link for this mount is in the info bar below. Insert the shoe adapter into your camera shoe. Be sure to turn the adjustment wheel until the adapter is secured tightly to your camera. Next. Attach the tablet mount to your shoe adapter, again making sure to tighten the connections until they're snug. Connect the USB cable that came with your camera to the port under the rubber cover on your Nikon D3200. If you're like me, you probably lost that cable a long time ago, so find a replacement. Connect the micro USB OTG adapter cable to the port on your tablet, and then plug the free end of your camera's USB cable into the adapter. Now you're connected. Next, find a camera app that works for your camera. I've chosen DSLR Dashboard. It's a free app, and although I haven't tested every feature, it seems to work well with the Nikon D3200. Install the app and open it. Make sure your camera is powered on and select Search for USB Camera. Once the app is up and running, select LV for Live View Mode. If you have everything working properly, you should now be able to see the live view through your camera's lens displayed on your tablet. Uh, just a note here for Nikon D3100 owners, the D3100 does not support functions like live view and focus adjustment from a remote device. You will not be able to do this with a D3100. From this stage forward, you can control your camera's functions from your tablet. For D3200 owners frustrated with the camera's lack of a bracket feature, You'll be happy to know DSLR Dashboard allows you to bracket shots, functionally expanding the capabilities of your camera. You'll want to play with the app settings to get them to your liking. For instance, if you like to review your shots on the big screen after you take them, you'll want to set DSLR Dashboard to display each shot automatically after each capture. That's it, the Nikon Nexus. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it helpful. We'll see you next time.